friends. Hope everyone is doing well. I am so excited because I want to share with you something that I have learned just recently that has changed my life for the better, right? And so why would I not want to share this with you? Uh, so Dr. Mindy Peltz, she is this brilliant, wonderful lady that encouraged me to do this. And she has all this free material on the benefits of fasting. Now, of course, disclaimer, I'm not a medical professional. Consult your healthcare professional, your doctor, make your own decisions. This is simply sharing my experience, right? And so she really broke down all of the extreme, mind-blowing benefits of a process called autophagy, okay? It's a very fancy word, but when you enter into the fasting process and specifically enter into the fasting process at 16, 17 hours where you are not eating for 16, 17 hours, you stimulate a process called autophagy. So autophagy, autophagy. actually means self-eating, right? And so the cells, your body, God created our bodies very, very smart. And inside of it, there are mechanisms, healing mechanisms that can be turned on. Um, and so this autophagy actually promotes um, cellular death, which does not sound good, but it is good when you want to get rid of the viruses, the microbes, the pathogens, um, all the cells that no longer serve you, the cells that are, you know, all being gunked up and just yucky and need to be recycled to start uh, new cell development. Um, so around 16, 17 hours of not eating, your body switches over into this repair mode, essentially. Um, and so, so for a while, I guess just to back up a little bit, I did practice intermittent fasting, um, which actually around the 12 hour window, um, of, of, so you're not eating, um, and you know for 12 hours consecutive which which that was quite easy for me just because you know I, I can drink black coffee and water and all the things and um so I, I would do that normally until about 12 um because i know you know human growth hormone um is it that helps to stimulate human growth hormone uh, which is essential for anti-aging and muscular development and all the things we want, right? And so, um, but then I, this week, thank you, Dr. Mindy Peltz with her group resetters. Uh, she went in detail so many, I don't know how many videos, she has tons of videos about the potential benefits that you can experience when you actually take this harder step, and yes, I will share my experience because it is harder, uh, but when you do things that are harder, you can actually get better results. Um, it's just that mindset, renewing your mindset um, into a place of belief that you go, you know what, this is worth it, I'm going to do it. And so finally, I got to that place where I said, this is worth it, and I'm gonna do it. And the the autophagy Autophagy. really intrigued me because i thought wait a second this is kind of like a step above uh the intermittent fasting where i can uh, actually have my body switch into fat burning mode right and um so you actually have all of these wonderful wonderful uh developments that happen as you practice uh, this fasting. So basically what I did specifically is I would stop eating um, the night before, you know, 
I work out in the evenings. I we don't eat till late, and so really, by the time I sit down, it's after eight, and so I know it's not the best to eat late, and so that for that reason too, I like to fast in the morning. Um, but I you I stopped all eating because I even like to snack a little bit. Um, at 10 p.m., which I know it sounds really late, but again, I'm working out in the evening. Um, and then not till the next day would I eat anything till 2 p.m. And I did that for three days in a row. Okay, so here was my experience, right? My experience was the first day, it really wasn't that hard because I will back up and say, you know, that one hour I, between, I was even fine at 1 p.m., but between 1 and 2 p.m., I thought, oh, Jenny, this is hard. This is hard. Started feeling low energy. And, uh, but this deep detoxification process is worth it, right? And so we want to see those anti aging benefits. We want uh, to tap into this inner healing mechanism that has the potential to reset your hormones if your hormones are have a hormonal imbalance or um, can actually help with brain health. Uh, and so why would I not? Why would I not try this? And oh, I'm so glad I did. I'm so glad I did. Um, so again, you know, this is not advice for you. This is just for education and uh, as, as far as educating you on my experience and Hopefully you'll check down uh, below. I'll link her videos, which she she gets into the science of it, which I find very, very interesting. I love listening to science. And um, but she also has a, a beautiful gift of really breaking it down to something very, very easy to understand. So basically, the Cliff's Notes version is it's a housekeeping process that your body turns on uh, just like as a, a drawer is gets really, really cluttered, right? So uh, eventually you want to get rid of all the cells that are no longer serving you, right? And so you want to get rid of the old damaged cells and the old intracellular, uh, it's an intracellular mechanism that is turned on, this autophagy. And so autophagy. Um, I, you know, the first day, like I said, was not really that difficult. Day two, okay, <laughs> getting more difficult on day two. I actually found that I needed to sleep more during these days, which I also found interesting because she said sleeping, you want to sleep more during your autophagy process. Autophagy. So I was like, okay, well, that kind of worked out. Um, so I did get really, really sleepy and I did get hungry and all the things. Uh, but I did notice that my body was getting rid of stuff, detoxifying, and uh, you know my skin felt like it looked a lot better. I experienced mental sharpness. The brain fog was gone, okay? So a lot of mental sharpness and focus, um, which I thought was interesting because she did talk about the benefits that it brings to brain health, and I actually personally experienced that. So um, also, yes, I did lose some weight and I feel like my muscle definition was a little bit better. I do also, um, you know, some some high intensity exercise and other things that help to um, facilitate that. Uh, but I did just have black coffee and water. Now, she even mentioned you can have MCT oil in your coffee. Um, there's other things that are not going to throw you out of the autophagy Zone. autophagy um but when you do end up eating when you break that uh window that 16 17 hour window uh and and begin to eat you want the food not to be protein but to be fat which i found very very interesting and to keep while you're in the autophagy autophagy but uh you know you want to keep 20 grams or under on the protein or else it can throw you out um so really, honestly, she has a book. She has the videos. This, like I said, it's just to kind of whet your thirst uh, and your interest to learn more about it. 
Um, but, you know, sharing, I had to come on and share. I actually did it for three days in a row. And I thought, you know, this is a tool. I'm not going to do it all the time. I may do it a couple times a, a month. I, I don't know. Um, but there are, you know, if you're a woman with your cycle, there's times that you should and there's times that you shouldn't fast. And she gets into all of that um, and all the technical um, things. And it's benefit for both men and for women and, you know, at any, all these different ages. And, and she's just so helpful and so energetic. And I just really, really appreciate uh, that she's just dispersing this information um, to the public and making us aware of uh, these free, creative, uh, internal mechanisms that God has already uh, placed inside our very intelligent bodies from um, our creator, right? And so, uh, yes, yeah, so we all want to look younger. Um, so anti-aging, longevity, uh, hacks, uh, weight loss, all that. If you find it interesting or just, you know, want to learn more about it for your health, uh, check out Dr. Mindy Peltz, her videos. Um, I tend to get obsessed listening to certain people and she is the one that I want to learn everything that she has. And my goodness, I will be listening to more of her videos. So I will link them below. Uh, please check it out. And again, this is your personal decision. This is just me sharing my experience. So the results, yes, you are pressing into the heart or she, as she mentions, you pulse into the heart. Um, but you have to do that sometimes to get uh, the results that you want. And so really it's that mindset shift. Um, it's a growth mindset. It's something that we are all having to do every single day. So uh, please like and subscribe. I just like to share, come on here. Um, anything that is creative, anything that is helpful, I like to share with you. So hope you have the best day and be blessed. Talk to you later.